Moving up for the first. First of three trials here at Kilmore. Two-year-old or better. Over 2,180 metres. Field of five to run for the first. Mobile, mobile gathers speed. It's the Nutrient Equine Mobile. Mobile swings around the home bend and they're close to a start. First trial. And there goes the green light on. And they're off and racing in the first trial. Mitzi said and also Tally Ho Joe begins quickly and it's going to be Tally Ho Joe to the winning post the first time. Leading by five metres to in second placing in the field to Mitzi said as they're going out of the straight the first time. Three back on the marker pegs in third placing is always the showman. Then rolling Mary in fourth position and six metres away to raise ideal at the tail of field. Making the way towards the back straight for the first time and it's Tally Ho Joe for Luke Kilduff in front. Keen to go up in front. Down the back straight for the first time and leads by eight metres to in second placing in the field to Mitzi said. Six metres away in third placing to Always the Showman. Then there's a good gap of about 15 metres away to Rolling Mary and about 10 away to Raise Ideal at the Taylor Field. So it's a solid run trial heading off the back straight. Lead time pretty good, 42.7, and with about 1,300 metres left to go. King to go is Tally Ho Joe. Leads by four metres here to On the Leader's Back in second placing is Mitzi Said. Always a showman, three back the marker pegs in third placing. 15 metres away to Rolling Mary and Ray's Ideal about eight metres away at the tail of field. First quarter of the last mile in 30.7. That was wind assistance approaching the winning post, Judge and Bell with a circuit left to go. Tally Ho Joe is the leader. It's three metres clear to Mitzi said behind the leaders back in second position. Always a showman, three back. Them. Now, the leader just wanted to run off the track here. Not too sure what happened to Tally Ho Joe, but it's restraining towards a tamon of half choke down going past the 800 metre mark, where Mitzi said now takes over and lead, leads by four to five metres. So, always a showman behind the leader's back in second position. 15 metres away, Rolling Mary third, then followed by Ray's Ideal, and just dropping right out of it is Tally Ho Joe. Second quarter of the last mile in 33.9. They've got 500 metres left to run, and it's Mitzi set for Monique Burnett. Leads by eight metres. Always a showman in second position. Then there's a good gap of about 40 metres away in third placing to Rolling Mary, Ray's Ideal, and 35 to 40 metres away to Tally Ho Joe. Heading off the back straight in 26. 7.7 7 the third quarter. Coming around the final bend, and Smitsy said nicely clear for Monique Burnett. It's 12, 15 metres clear. Holding down in second position there is always a showman, but Mitzi said it's going to bolt in. Opens up and is going to win by about 15. Mitzi said first, always the showman in second position. Rolling Mary's in third. They're coming in intervals, then followed by in fourth position to raise ideal. And Tally Ho Joe, the early leader, knocked up to finish towards the tail of the field. Last quarter in 29, and the mole rate 21.1 after the first trial. Lead time of 42.7. Sectionals 30.7, 33.9, 27.7, and the run home in 29 seconds. Gross time 2.44. Mile rate of 21.1. 21.1 for the mile rate. And the placings in the first, it's 4, 2 and 1. 4, 2 and 1. Fourth into number 3 and fifth into number 6. So it's 4, 2, 1, 3 and 6. 4, 2, 1, 3 and 6 after the opening trial with more details to follow.